Hey, it's me, Jimmy D, and welcome to this week's episode review reaction of Samurai Jack, episode 6. Yeah. Um, Your yeah, computer's working. My computer's working. We're not on Overwatch anymore. Thank God. And you're not talking to yourself. And I'm not talking to myself. That was a technical <laughs> difficulty. I'm not crazy. Okay. You're not crazy. I'm a little crazy. But let's get you to Samurai Jack. Right let's get to Samurai Jack. Um, if this is a good episode, like travel episode. This is kind of stories I like. Um, uh, let, I'll, I'll let you uh, get your opinion uh, first, Hubbard. Uh, okay, I will not be planned. We didn't plan about the same. Um, it's just I mean, okay. Go for it, cause I need to think through for a second. Okay, well. It's good to, and refreshing to get to see this story take place in this episode with Aku's daughter. And see that path instead of just being completely surrounded by uh, Samurai Jack. Because it, it just, it's refreshing. It, it gives a new sense and taste to the, to the show. Um, and it also adds that, um, uh, what's, what's the word for it? I don't know. I can't think of the word, but, um, it just, it was refreshing to see this and it was enjoyable to see a different point of view, to see how, what's like the effect Samurai Jack has on people around, um, and then that ending, man, where, like, Samurai is about to kill himself before she, uh, snaps him out of it. Um, I say this every damn week, but it was one of my favorites. Um, I, I enjoy, I really enjoyed this episode. And I knew, I, this, this was the... F Last week was the first time I actually watched the previews. Um, because, well, Samurai Jack walked away. And, like, I, how do you not watch the previews for that episode? The next one. And, uh... <coughs> I was excited to see this one. Because I like these type of stories where a show's main character is not in the episode. And you're trying to, like, a journey and all. Like, that's what I like. And so I, I was excited for this episode. And... It paid off. But, uh, like I have a question. Yes. How many of those past people do you recognize? Because this, because because if you recognize pretty much every single one of them, uh -huh. it, it plays. It makes it so much better. Like every time they show someone. I, I mean, I recognized a, a few from the the past, but I I didn't. Uh... It's been so long like, since I actually watched Samurai Jack, like the old seasons. Uh, same here. Same same for me, but like I remember like all those like I don't I don't remember the name or the what it's but I remember the story what those S of that he that helped them. Yeah. Yes. So for like for me, uh, it was part, for me. This is probably one of the greatest S word, finest one that has so far because it it, 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 it really pulls from the it past. Just, it, it pulls from the past and it just shows, you know, it, yeah, like I said, it, like, it shows, like, the effect that he made mm -hmm. upon, you know, helping these people. Yes. You got the, like, how the life got, how the lives, how the lives seem so much better. Yeah. Yet, despite the fact that, you know, it's, it's been like 50 years later, that's, you know, just a cool story, you know, being a dumb, you know, being an asshole and such. But yet, his life is still fantastic just yeah. because of him. Yeah. One person can change a lot. One person can change a lot. Um, and, and that and ending, he, when he actually does snap out of it, and he goes, I like your hair. That's a nice dress. Like, that. that's just... It was funny. It was funny. Um, But yeah, like you said, the few people I did recognize from the past, it... I, yes, it it it, it show it really like pulls at you a little bit more, but um, and it it kind of adds that importance to 
this episode like even more. Um, but even if you didn't recognize it, just seeing the effects Samurai Jack has on people is just it pays off for the viewer. Yeah. Um, what was your favorite part? My favorite part in... of the episode. Hmm. I think it has to be the part where my favorite part has to be the part when Archie scrub up the the her cleanse herself. Mm -hmm. like, sort of like you know, like a like a born like a like a what's it like how, well what like that thing what is it called a a reborn virgin or something. Uh -huh. it's just, it's just stuff that she just cleans up that oh she just cleans up all sin and start completely freshly new. Yeah, I, that that that's near the top of my list too. It's just. Like, this this episode had so many, like, m like emotions mixed in with it. And it really... I mean, look at the ending, for example. You have the comic relief at the end, but Samurai Jack was about to kill himself. Like, just, just those two, like, at opposition to one another, just really... <laughs> You know, it's amazing. Like, no, speaking of the end, speaking of the ending, yeah. That, that period, the horseman. Yeah. He was an actual person, not a. Yeah. At least I think he. Apparently, like, I thought he was the actual was, person. Like. I thought he was some kind of mental no, image. No, I I thought he was a ghost at first. But, then I, I was like, oh. Okay. Yeah, then, like, when you see this part, it's like, oh, he's yeah. actually a real Dean. I did, because the way the visuals that they provide with him just made it seem like he was just another mental creation from Samurai Jack. Yes. Yeah, really. And then, you know, you cut the, like I said, you get to this point, and you're like, oh, he's actually a yeah. actual person. He's an actual just person. Been, this has been stalking Jack the whole time. Yeah. Which is kind of creepy, but... <laughs> um, um, I'm surprised you didn't mention a, 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 a cool uh, a number one, or at least so-called number one assassin. Well, I gotta leave some things for you to mention. <laughs> really? No, um... I don't know, I just... This episode had a lot in it. So, like... I felt like the ending and then just the effect of seeing people was the most important thing for the episode. Well, I mean, not only that, but the part of, uh, what was his name? Uh, Shem Shemaru. Yeah, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. I mean, he, I think he plays he plays the role because remember he was trying to tell Ku that Jack didn't have his sword. I mean, that's Aku didn't know. Yeah, still yeah, doesn't true, know. True. So true. I still feel like that, knowing the fact that this dude's still running around, you know, hippity hopping his way to Aku. <laughs> uh, uh, there may be a moment where uh, that Aku might get that fire reunited into him once again. Yeah, I didn't think about that. And next episode, Samurai is gonna go get his sword. Well, at least in the coming you know, episodes. It's going, to, it's going to be the beginning. Yeah. Of course, he, he's going to go get that sword. the fact that, of course, hopefully Aku does not find out yeah. beforehand. If he does, Otherwise, it's going to be a shit show. It's going to, be, thought, it's but, going to go down. How, yeah, but I also noticed something. Yeah. Well, okay, remember when those, well, remember when those, all those three guys like mentioned they would help out a semi when he, in his time of need? Yeah. I got a feeling that maybe this final episode may be like a huge battle be between Aku oh. and and Jack with his friends. Oh. So like a like a battle like it's like two big just basically two formal army just going at each other. Oh. Oh my god. 
So, damn. I sort just, of like the, that, sound, that sounds really good. Sort of, sort that of sounds like really comic. good. Yeah. Like the comic, like the any of the comic over there they had a while long ago. Yeah. They kind of... Huh. That's interesting. You, Let me know in the comments below what you think about that. Because... Wow. That's going to be nice to see. That, that would be awesome. That would be awesome. Just, like, that's probably, like, the end that everyone wanted to see. Just yeah. literally the battle. That would be just... fantastic. <laughs> and next week's episode looks great. I saw the preview. I know. And except for, like, after next week, we're only down to, like, three yes or left. Yeah, this is... This is episode six. We only have four left. Four weeks, a month. You have a month left. That's it. But yeah, uh, let me know in the comments below what you think of the episode. What do you think of the season so far? Uh, what do you think about Hubbard's little uh, army idea thing? And uh, thank you so much for watching. Prediction? Yeah, prediction. Uh, it's late. Um, words. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. And like always, I will see you in the next one. Later.